to hear. Do you feel this strong wind? Yes, I can hardly remain standing. Do you see a dark thundercloud over there? Wow, it's so big. It gets stuffy, windy, and it starts drizzling. All these are the signs of a tornado. What is it? A tornado is a very powerful whirlwind, high and wide. It spins at extreme speed. Does it go inside everything that comes to close? Right. It's better to stay as far away from it as possible. Look, it's a forest fire. It's very difficult to put it out. It flares up too quickly. In most cases, fires happen because of people. If you don't put out your campfire completely and have some burning coals behind, sparks can land on dry grass and the fire will engulf the entire forest. Burning trash, leaving glass bottles in the sun and setting off fireworks can also cause fires. So, does it mean we can't make fireworks anymore? But they are so beautiful. You can't do it in the forest. There are other, better suited places. But even there, you should remain cautious. Sometimes, forest fires are caused by certain natural phenomena. For example, lightning, volcanic eruptions, or even fire fang. If temperatures reach more than 120 degrees Fahrenheit. And how can people get to a fire burning in the forest? It's almost impossible. They need to use aviation to dump water in the place where a fire is raging. is amazing, but it can also be dangerous. You need to know about this if you want to stay safe. And of course, we need to protect nature because it's our common home. Let's go! We have so much to see and to learn. See you later! <laughs>